You waltzed in with a smirk. We all sniggered. I don't have a valid explanation, perhaps because you were bigger? Or because your hair was aglow like a traffic light that says if it's clear you can go? You were confident, yet you didn't know what you were getting yourself in for with a class full of girls. Child development was a strange choice, but we weren't aware you were about to change our worlds. We shouldn't have laughed as you reeled off your unusual family tree, but we did. And you laughed with us. We were just kids, you see. That week, we spoke for hours. What I'd give for those hours again. Without hesitation, you made friends with everyone. Within days, they all knew your name. Our friendship spiralled quickly and was built on a long-lasting foundation. I'm bailing you out of awkward situations at midnight at a petrol station. If there was ever an opportune moment to make a sexual innuendo, you definitely got those covered. Endless conversations surrounding hookers and blow. Only you could have gotten a job serving pints illegally at the pub. You were a mere 17 giving out free drinks and free grub. Our car rides in the gold day were belting Afro man as loud as you could, pulling up next to innocent strangers to talk to them about morning wood. That phone call. It hit my stomach right at the pit. He was in an accident and he didn't make it. All our worlds crumbled. You'll never know the extent to which you impacted all our lives and left your Jordan shaped indent in our hearts, in our minds, on the school. You really were one of a kind. Walking into the exam hall, your chair sat empty. I felt pain see her through us as we looked around as if you were going to appear. The first time we saw our teachers, the emotion made us weak. The history teacher you perved on all year, she broke, unable to speak. Since that day, I've struggled to fully express how much I miss your ginger hair and the way you like to dress. Anytime I hear that song, I can't help but feel you there as I emotionally sing along. No matter how much time passes, it doesn't get any easier to process that the world has lost a human who was destined for such greatness. Within your short life, you made yourself more memorable than most. You're a connection that draws so many people together and keeps nostalgia close. You may now be a memory, but you are the most treasured one we keep. Rest easy, Jord, and don't forget us. Until we meet again when I fall asleep.